Desert sand don't ask questions It don't wonder where I've been It understands it's my obsession To come and go with you G'day guys, Kimmy Rust Adventures here again, aren't we? Hi. <laughs> We've got a special little surprise for you today, haven't we, Barry? We have. Yes, yes, we've got a cooking segment. Kim's cooking segment, this one, isn't it? Yep. And the reason why we're doing this cooking segment is because <laughs> an idiot on YouTube, this idiot. Well, there you go, guys. So that is pancakes made out of an egg and a banana. It doesn't get any more bloody simple than that. As you saw, it worked. It's delicious. That's it. So even if you don't take this out with you on your next bloody motorcycle trip, Give it a shot in the bloody, in the backyard, in your man cave, in the kitchen. Kick the missus out, bloody jump in there and say, this idiot on YouTube said to give this a, sh a shot. Yeah, well, I didn't call him an idiot. He called himself an idiot. Now, that is Mark Victor. He does a man cave um, Tuesday. Tuesday, every Tuesday, yeah. but that wasn't man cave Tuesday. That was, what was it, babe? Um, oh, he's camp camping. cooking. Yeah. Yeah, shit easy camp cooking, he used to call it, but he doesn't call it that no more. See? Have a look at this. Right, so he's cooking a banana pancake for camp cooking, isn't he? Yep. Kim reckons her recipe's a lot better. So, Mark Victor, look out, there's a new cat in town, isn't yep. there? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> so, we're going to run through that with you and just show you our version of the camp cooking pancake. So we'll cut back to you in a sec. So here we go. We have one banana. That's the main ingredient of this pancake. Banana pancake. An egg. We have one egg. A little bit of butter for the pan and a little bit of flour. It's self-rising flour. Not too much flour though. Okay. So what we do is we start off with the banana. We'll grab the fork and give it a mash. And apparently you've got to mash this up a fair bit until it's really mushy. Okay, so what I'm doing now is I'm going to mash it up to a pulp. It's got to be a real gooey consistency. So while I'm doing that, um, we might cut back to you. Okay, so that's around about the consistency you want it. So it's nice and sloppy. Okay, so we'll add the egg. Eggshell free, of course. And then we just mix. So as you can see, that's fairly runny. That's why we're gonna add a little bit of self-rising flour to it just so it thickens up just a slight little bit. Probably gonna have to use it all, I reckon. Yeah, look at that, it's starting to thicken up nice in here. So, I think that'll do, and now we'll add the secret ingredient. What's the secret ingredient? Ha 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 ha, two is five seat cider. Now, yeah. who hasn't got alcohol with them when they're making pancakes? Exactly. On a camping trip. I guess you could use anything, um, you know, as long as it's sweet. It's, it'll be apple and banana then. Ooh, apple and banana pancakes. Oh, look at that. Yes. It's a milky consistency, isn't it? Oh, it smells nice. It smells very nice. All right, that's good. Set that aside and we'll set up this pan. Okay. So we're gonna let this heat up. Got a nice flame going there. Okay. Little bit of butter. So just let that melt. Pan's gotta be fairly, fairly warm so the pancakes don't run. I'm gonna pop two in here, see how we go. There we go, so it's starting to sizzle there now. Radio. Um so when we're not going to fill the spoon up, so we're going to give it a chance to run a little bit. Okay, so one. They're not going to be completely round, but I guess that doesn't matter. So we'll let that 
cook there and when it starts bubbling on the top, uh, I guess that's time to flip it. Okay, so bubbles have just started forming on the top. So I'm just gonna flip it and see how we go. Oh yes, got it just in time, I reckon. You can see that butter's just starting to burn a little bit. First ones always turn out a little bit like that though, until you condition the pan, isn't it? That's right. Just move him over a little bit, there we go. Okay, so I think they're ready. Let's have a look. Yeah, I think that pan's probably a little bit too hot there now, but I might turn, turn him, him down. down a bit. Okay, so the next step is plating up. Mind the fingers. We'll spread a little bit of butter on there. And that there is our apple and banana pancake. Right, so she's cooked me brekkie, hasn't she? Move that over, babe, and it's a bit warm. we will try our pancakes, aren't we? Move him over, yep, she'll be right. Okay, so just be careful, babe, they're gonna be hot. Gonna be hot. So this is our camping pancake. Mm. <laughs> is it nice? Mm-hmm. Mm. Those ones always turn out a little bit brown, don't they? Mm. I'll tell you what though. Mm, that is nice. That is very nice indeed. I can taste the tang of the five seed cider. My word, I can too. Mm. Yeah. And, what? and it's not too bad. It's fairly fluffy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, mm, that is, as Mark Victor puts it, Shit Easy Camp Cooking, mm -hmm. or Easy Camp Cooking now, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Google doesn't like it. So Mark Victor, that's our version of these pancakes. <laughs> Try them, guys. Try them, guys. There's a new cat in town, Mark. Mm -hmm. Look out. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Catch you next time, guys. Bye. Bye.